All right, Don. Welcome to my world. What an extraordinary house. <laughs> my. I suppose it's not your everyday mansion. Um, it, I've got models dressed in everything I've ever worn. Show me some discipline. I'll show you mine. Please show some discipline. I'll show you mine. Oh, the Art Deco lighthouse lights. I collect stuff. lighthouses because I live opposite Baron Jury Lighthouse. Oh. It's more like a live-in dream than a house. I've well, done is, all huh? these effects here in all in the 20 months I've been here. Love your pantry. Been here. Think that's sensational. It's fantastic. It oh. really works. That's my kombucha tea coming up in the oh, jars over there. Yes, which we had on the show a little while ago. We're then. a health food household. <laughs> all right, Don, welcome to my studio. My goodness, it's full of everything. What, what are these? Oh, well, there's a few deco bags in there. Oh, aren't there ever? <laughs> Uh, this is a shoe collection. There's My a few breakneckers over here. How would anybody actually wear them? It isn't too easy, I can tell you. You have to be dedicated. <laughs> that is the most extraordinary shoe I think I've ever seen in my well, life. Well, you haven't looked at that one there. Which, oh, the, the, the other black one there? Yes. Are they, these are what you'd call platform shoes, are they? They are. They're platform. what I'd call platform Stiletto. shoes. How about you? <laughs> my goodness, yes. <laughs> Voila! Woo! Woo! The last judgment according to Lash, Mark 1, <laughs> a work in progress. So all these people? They're all friends of mine. Um, some of them now no longer with us. I'm never alone when I, when I lather up in ah. a bathroom like this. Well, have you ever seen a dungeon like this before? It's just the chicest little dungeon. It is a real dungeon, isn't it? <laughs> yep. And what are all these wonderful doors? These are prison doors from a cogger lockup. Look, it says decommissioned cell, not to be used for holding purposes. And this is the anything can happen bedroom. Someone can be tied to it and then. <laughs> oh, I see. <laughs> and you can be in or out with or without them. Show me some discipline. I'll show you mine. If, if you were elected, who goes to the Senate, Gretel or Madame Lash? Oh, they'll never know who they're going to get, Gretel, Madame Lash or the Immaculate Lash. What I can promise is every day is going to be showtime. <laughs> Go forward. Coming up next, we create the ultimate fantasy art deco garden. It's not too late to whip it. A whip it good. Well, be it ever so humdrum, Palm Beach on Sydney's northern peninsula is home to the rich like Kerry Packer and the infamous like Gretel Pinninger. But it's Gretel's business plans that are raising temperatures in the million dollar mortgage belt. She's better known as Madame Lash, and she wants to turn her home into a guest house with some interesting extra services. Andrew Gagan is safely back from a preview. It's not surprising local residents call Palm Beach paradise. With multi-million dollar homes nestled into the hill overlooking the Pacific, this suburb on Sydney's northern beaches is home to the rich and famous. Among them, Kerry Packer and Madame Lash. Madame Lash, whose real name is Gretel Pinninger, wants to make this her business address. The question is, what is her business? I'm in the business of winning friends and influencing people. I want anyone, everyone who's interested to come and check me out with a view to maybe becoming extra dimensionalists along with me. This is the Sacred Heart bedroom with the Enlightenment ceiling. 
Gretel has renovated her home and is opening it as a guest house. I just thought a device for doing that and having party people around Christmas time was to say I was open as a guest house. Heavens, everybody rents pla places up here. Mm, mm, oh. Mm. Oh, oh, mm. This has raised the ire of local residents. Mm. But I don't think the uh, residents down there would be uh, tickle pink about having a guest house there. Bill Dean is a typical Palm Beach resident. He retired here to get away from it all. Because we do attract a lot of uh, tourists, but I don't think the residents of uh, Florida Road would be particularly happy about it. The residents aren't too sure where I'm coming from. There's speculation in this community that Madame Lash indulges in some questionable activity. I mean, how could you have this? Well, come and have it. Check me out any time. My door is always open. It is not a, not a brothel. I'm immaculate. She calls herself an artist. Look, I spent two and a half months, night and day, when I wasn't sleeping, at work on that painting, a work in progress. How could I have time to run a brothel? I haven't made money from sex. I'm an artist. I'm, and I don't sell my art either. This is a 